my name is Alyssa Freeman and I'm a classical pianist and piano teacher and the creator of the Her Classical Project. You can read more about this project at herclassical.com. In this video, you'll be hearing a piece by Maria Hester Reynolds Park, and if you'd like to learn more about her, then you can go to the video linked below. The piece I'll be playing is a waltz that Park wrote for the keyboard, and here's a little bit about that piece. First of all, this is one of the earliest examples of a waltz written for the keyboard, though there were a few written before, especially in Austria and Germany. The piece was written in 1801, which was just 10 years after the waltz reached England in 1791. When it did, by the way, there was definitely a public shock, especially at the closeness the dance partners were to each other in public. Maria Hester Park's waltz starts off with an introduction to the waltz, and this introduction is quite grandiose, with large rolled chord dotted rhythms and lots of quick notes. The waltz portion of this piece is interesting because it's in quite small sections, each with a completely new theme and each of them with repeats. I've added variations on the repeats, which was common practice during the classical era. The dedication to, of this piece says, composed and respectfully dedicated to Lady Mary Bentinck. The grandiose intro demonstrates an air of nobility and respect, though I would say that the choice of a waltz is interesting since it was such a controversial dance at the time. I think it's totally fitting that Park did compose a waltz since, as I mentioned in her composer intro video, her music is the perfect accompaniment to Jane Austen's novels. I can imagine those heroines playing this piece in their drawing rooms and thinking of past evenings at a ball. I hope you enjoy listening to this waltz by Maria Hester Reynolds Park. Thank you. 